Hi, this is Brad Linder with Lilliputing, and this is Dell's new venue, uh, 8 7000 series, Correct, yep. which is a uh, very thin, very light tablet running six Google Lens. Yep. Uh, six millimeters, one of the thinnest tablets around, and it has a high resolution 2560 wow. by 1600 That's pixel correct. display. Yes. And um, Intel's, uh, which processor? Uh, this is the uh, Moorfield. Intel's Moorfield more processor, processor. And it's also uh, the first tablet of its type to come with a real sense uh, camera for depth uh, uh, adjustments and photos. So tell me a little bit about how that real sense so, yeah, camera works. The first thing you'll notice is actually that when, when we talk about real sense, this actually has three separate cameras on the device itself. It's the only one currently that does. And when you take a picture, it actually takes uses all three of those simultaneously. So to give you an idea of what that means is it creates a three-dimensional object in terms of depth. So if I go into a, a picture, it allows me to adjust this. I'm actually filtering based on the depth of an object. So this was a black and white image, and what I can do is based on the depth, I can filter through and isolate certain objects at various depths. Uh, based on that three-dimensional element. The other thing that allows me to do, which I love because I mess up often, is I can literally refocus after the picture's been taken. So I can isolate this area based on its depth, or I can refocus a picture based on a, on a different depth um, behind it. So those are some things that you can do. One last thing I will show you, the camera's also calibrated to notice spatial relativity. So if I go in here and look at the measurement, I can go in and actually measure in reality what that object is, in this case 6 foot 11 inches. So it really changes what we as a consumer are able to do on a handheld device uh, with respect to photography, uh, etc. Okay, so RealSense is a technology. There's a couple of different things that we've seen Absolutely. grouped under RealSense. Uh -huh. Some devices have 3D cameras right. that you know, let you sort of do gesture recognition. This isn't that kind of RealSense. Instead, it has that depth sensing. Depth. So when you're creating a photo, instead of just snapping a single 2D image, uh, you've actually got extra depth in it. Now, if right. I wanted to export these photos, I can basically edit it, right. save it as a JPEG, and email yeah. it to my friends. So yeah, it is a JPEG with some meta uh, meta metadata built over the top of it. So if my device is optimized for depth, then I can do all this. If it's not, it just looks like any other JPEG image. Okay. Yep. Uh, this tablet's available now. It's uh, launched during CES uh, for yeah. about $399. Correct. And um, again, even if you don't want the 3D sensing technology, it's uh, one of the thinnest, lightest uh, yeah, Android tablets around. It's the thinnest uh, tablet in the marketplace. Yeah. Um, it just won a Best of CES award uh, based on its form factor for overall performance. Right. And it's got that um, Intel's Morefield processor, high resolution display, Correct. and Android software. So that's a look at Dell's new Venue 8 7000 series Android tablet with Intel RealSense. And the name itself just takes forever to say. But, uh, but the, you know, it does have some interesting features that you won't find on a lot of other devices. Uh, including, and this is a AMOLED display. What's that? This is a AMOLED display, I think, or uh, that I'm not sure. Of. Okay, um, it's definitely very, very uh, vibrant in terms yeah, of colors, though. So, yeah. yeah. So. Do you know that much? The screen technology uh, is AMOLED, or. Um, uh, I don't know that. Okay. I don't know that. That's okay. Well, I'm, I'm, I'm recording video. We can uh, you can go to lilliputing.com for more details to, to find that out. So this is Brad Linder again with Lilliputing at uh, Dell's new tablet with Intel RealSense at CES 2015.